I was born to a single mom, Michelle. Didn't know my dad growing up at all. And my grandmother and my grandfather and others tried to, you know, pitch in. But ultimately, it was just my mom and I. It was tough for her, working 80 to 100 hour weeks and trying to raise a son. I started drinking in middle school. That continued to accelerate as I got into high school. I had to go to a treatment facility or was out on my own. Trying to maintain sobriety is one of the toughest challenges I've ever faced. You start from the bottom and you have to rebuild everything. I was fortunate to have really great people in my life and great family and great mentors to help me build to become the person that, that I knew I wanted to be. It shifted the direction of my life dramatically. I swore into the Navy JAG Corps in 2004. In 2006, I, I volunteered to go over to Iraq with a Army Military Police Brigade. It was a tough job, there's no question. As lieutenant in the Navy, Adam Laxalt and his unit assisted in the detention and prosecution of thousands of war criminals and terrorists. He returned home to Nevada, started a family with his wife, Jamie, and answered the call of service once again as our Attorney General. I'd served in a military capacity, but now I want to serve in, in the public sector and make Nevada a better place. One of the most important responsibilities of my job is to protect the most vulnerable in our state. Whether it's a senior that's being taken advantage of, victims of sexual assault or human trafficking. The ones who need a champion, someone in their corner when no one else is. Adam Laxalt has been there. Fighting for justice on behalf of sexual assault victims, he's worked to fix the state's backlog of thousands of untested rape kits, led the charge to impose tougher penalties on sex offenders, secured a landmark human sex trafficking conviction in Las Vegas, took on the largest elder abuse prosecution ever conducted, and Adam Laxalt kept his promise to provide military personnel and their families with pro bono private sector legal services, the first program of its kind. As a veteran, I understand deeply the sacrifices they've all made for our state and for our country, and they shouldn't have to worry about legal troubles when they're deployed in a place like Iraq or Afghanistan. Fighting for every Nevadan and winning by leading. He's worked with officials in both parties and every state agency to keep our citizens safe, managing a $100 million budget and 400 state employees. His determination to make Nevada a better place has never been stronger. That's why Adam Laxalt's running for governor, to provide the strong, independent leadership we need to keep moving forward. I believe in this state. I believe that we have a great future in front of us. The Laxalt family came to Nevada in the early 1900s, and I still believe it's one of the, the great states for opportunity in the entire country. I want to make Nevada the most economically competitive state in the American West. We're going to be able to continue to grow our economy, our jobs. We can provide a better education for our children, and we can keep Nevada families safe. When I think of my two daughters, Sophia and Isabella, I want to make sure Nevada is the land of opportunity that, that my family found 100 years ago. Our families, our future, our state. Adam Laxalt for Nevada.